what's going on what's going on it is Miranda Dore and I am back for another video all right you guys so I will be reviewing this curly bob from NA Beauty it is gorgeous I'm living for it um it wasn't a long install process I really just had to wet the hair and we did baby hairs but getting to the look this will be a voiceover tutorial this is the hair this is the fix All right, so I received this hair from NA Beauty. This is a 150% density curly bob, 14 inch Brazilian hair, and it came with this little clip, and so cute, and another wig cap. I think this was too dark for me, but you know, all the necessities that you need with your wig. And then I went on to bleach the hair using my 40 volume developer and my quick blue bleach. I just put that on there for about 40 minutes, and I washed it out with this shimmering light shampoo this is my favorite it really helps to tone out the hair and make sure the lace isn't too orange so y'all just gonna watch me dunk this in the water honey i just dried the hair um with the old t-shirt and now i'm just gonna go in with this denman brush and this curl it up seal it butter Seal it up butter by aunt jackie's i absolutely love this this really helps to set those curls in you guys this hair was gorgeous like it did not take much at all for these curls to really just be popping on their own so i know this really helps to seal it in and moisturize the hair um i did not have to do any plucking on this unit it was ready to go and ready to be installed So while the unit was still wet, I just wanted to go ahead and install it. So I'm just going to pin it back. And I noticed that it was too small. The cap size was too small. This always happens to me. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to have to finesse it. I would rather my cap size be too big than it be too small. So I just had to adjust my um, cap. And so I'm going in with my Erica J glue. I think I did about two layers because I really didn't want this to be on that long, but yeah just get into it honey i love this erica j glue i probably use too much i'm going to start using it in you know smaller increments but this glue is absolutely amazing it really holds your wig down you don't need too much you can really do about two or three layers and your wig will really be on for a week as long as you are taking care of your hair So after I let those layers dry, I just went ahead and I pulled the wig forward and I got my comb and I just started brushing the hair right into the glue. But you want to make sure that you are doing this on the skin. So make sure that the glue and the hair is on the skin and not on your wig cap. So I'm just really just brushing that into my head honey we are melting and i really meant to cut this into three sections and i didn't think about it until after because i was rushing this day y'all i promise you I ended up cutting a little bit of the lace off and using this elastic band for about 30 minutes and then I went ahead and clipped the hair back again and cut off the rest of the lace using a eyebrow razor. Um, I love an eyebrow razor. It really creates the best, most natural looking hairline. You want that jagged cut. You don't want it to be too straight or your wig will really look so freaking fake. moving too quick i ended up cutting my freaking head y'all right at the part i was bleeding so freaking bad so i figured i wanted to do a side part so i went ahead and started parting my hair into a side part 
using that hot comb because this wig was thick like it was 150 percent density but this is some curly nice and kinky hair like it was very 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 thick so you're gonna see me just manipulating it getting my part right how i want it using my nairobi i just went ahead and set everything after i did the part and i wanted to just let it sit for a second Moving on, I went ahead with my face powder and I just went around the edges of the wig just to make sure everything was super blended. A little makeup on your wig does not hurt, honey. It just helps to blend and make it look as flawless as possible. Now it's time to do the baby hair. So around the whole perimeter of the wig, I'm just going to be pulling out hairs. Um, I wanted them to look very cute and very natural. Um, so I didn't do too many but i did enough for curly hair so yeah just watch me So this is a little trick that I learned. I learned to hot comb the edges and I even seen someone straighten them, um, but hot combing them, especially with curly hair, helps a little bit to just make them set even better and look more flawless. Once again, using that eyebrow razor, I just went ahead and cut the baby hairs at a diagonal angle so they just fall very even and pretty um i was struggling with this little razor y'all but it really makes the difference and i ended up cutting them too long but i didn't really shorten them until later but in this video um y'all are going to see me work with them so using that same nairobi mousse i just went ahead and started my baby hairs and y'all will see the process So after finally getting them right, I just went ahead with that wrapping paper that you get from the beauty supply store and my elastic band and let it sit for about 30 minutes. And the final step was just to really spray the hair and wet it up. And as you can see you all, I really love this color. It looks so pretty on me. Um, I've never done a curly bob, but I, Loved it. It was so stunning. Such a new look. And the baby hairs came out just right. So I'm definitely going to be throwing this unit back on soon. I would definitely recommend this hair as a beginner friendly unit. It is so easy to install. So pretty. And it's such low maintenance. It's giving very much 10 out of 10 for me. All right, you guys, so this is the finished look. I'm so sorry for my messy background, but we did a side part and yeah, it's melted for the cause. Honey, I love this freaking curly bob wig from NA Beauty. This is 150% density, curly bob, 14 inch, highlighted, and I did use purple shampoo on this hair. That's all I really did. Um, 
But yeah, you guys, I'm about to go out in just a minute, but I love how everything came out.